this is Season 5 of The Score, the Team Roping Journal's podcast where we cover the roping industry from top to bottom. This is where the team roping world talks. We talk through tough subjects, we talk big wins, and we talk real issues affecting the community. I'm your host and editor of the Team Roping Journal, Chelsea Schaefer. Hey everyone, welcome back to The Short Score. I'm your host, Jenna Link. On this week's episode, I got to talk with Levi Lord, who just won the Caldwell Night Rodeo with the Junior D's with an aggregate time of 17.8 seconds on three head, worth $4,980 each. You can catch the full story online at teamrepingjournal.com later this week, but you'll get a piece of the interview today. I hope you all enjoy this episode, brought to you by the WCRA. <laughs> You walk me through your runs. Um, yeah, first round, you know, the three header, we just kind of want to get the steer down. Uh, it's nice to place, nice to place, but if you don't have a good steer, then you can just kind of catch him and, and stay on average, and that's kind of where we ride. He, he, ran, he was a pretty good steer, but ran a little bit more, and we just made a pretty average run. We were 5'7. Um, came back on our second steer, didn't really like the steer, so then. At that point, we were just trying to make short rounds. We knew that two good rounds would make short rounds, so we just kind of the exact same thing on the second one, just kind of caught him, and, and we're six flat, came back fifth tall back. And then in those short rounds, it seems like if you just make a good run, you you can win money. And we didn't, we definitely didn't expect to win it, but just made a decent run on a good steer with 6-1 in the short round, and a couple other teams had just tough luck, and I guess it was just kind of our day. Yeah, that's awesome. Um, can you talk to me about the horse that you were riding? Yeah, that's Polly. Um, I rode him. I rode a different horse a lot this winter, but ever since we've been out to California and then uh, and then outside, uh, I've rode that horse pretty much every steer. And he's just a really good horse. He's not a. I don't think he's just a superstar, but he just does everything really easy. He doesn't really mess up too much, and just gives you the same go every time. That's awesome. Where did you get him from? I got him from Paul Eves. Uh, that's, I bought him right after the finals in 2020, after we had a good finals and had some money and, and needed another horse. So I kind of had my eye on him, and, and he's really been a good good horse for me. He's been a really good fit. He's, I've, I've had pretty good luck with him the last couple of years. <laughs> rodeo athlete looking for new ways to earn money? The WCRA World Champions Rodeo Alliance is all for rodeo and you can be too. How does the WCRA work and how do you earn money? Start by nominating any event you are going to be participating in prior to the performance start time. You can nominate anything with publicly verifiable results. Team roping jackpots, 40 barrel races, rough stock only events, or pro rodeos. Basically, any rodeo event counts. As long as the event has public and verifiable results, you are eligible to earn WCRA points. How do you start? Go to the App Store or Google Play Store, download the WCRA app on your mobile device. If you already have an account, hit Nominate, and if not, hit Register and create your account. Select your discipline and the date you ride or run. Verify you're nominating the current segment. Confirm your payment, and now it's time to compete and earn points. The WCRA team will track your results, and points will be awarded if and when you place and earn money. Nominate today and visit WCRA at WCRARodeo.com or on the WCRA Rodeo app for event information. to me about being in the top 15 what's your mindset right now oh it's uh it's an awesome position to be in especially this time of year um i guess probably after caldwell we we finally are to the point where i think we have enough money for sure to be in the nfr so 
it kind of takes a little bit of the pressure off um, and where you can just kind of enjoy it a little more being out here in the Northwest and, and everybody kind of loves being up here and it's a lot of good good radios and not, not so much travel so we can just kind of get up here and, and let the pressure off and just rope and, and try to win as much as we can and it's a, it's a really good position and we're really thankful to, to be in the top in the top five or whatever we are seven, <laughs> I guess right now but yeah but yeah cool um so where are you guys roping next uh, we roped at Kent Lake today our first one and now we go to Tremont Rapid City Bremerton and hopefully back to the Kent Lake short round and then San Juan on Sunday awesome well thank you so much <laughs>